What's going on guys? It's Whiteout here and I am back with some Minecraft adventures. I hope you guys enjoy the video and if you do, please don't forget to leave a rating and a comment. But let's get started with this. Today we have some Minecraft adventures with me and we are playing Minecraft on the Yaushcraft server. So uh, let's get this started. This is actually um, my second time back on the server since the Yaushcraft server came back up. They had it down for a while doing some rebuilding and some other stuff. Because they had some idiot griefers that came on here and just literally destroyed everything. So guys, they got a new spawn. They got a new everything. So guys, let's check this out. Let's read the rules. Welcome to Yaushcraft. Type slash rules to read our rules. Type help to see commands. Be respectful of all other people and buildings and slash spaces. Okay, you are in our new spawn region. Well, here you can't build, but are also invincible, so you can tour the sites safe. To go somewhere, you can build type slash warp old spawn or type slash warp spawn 2. It's a pretty cool little spawn here they got for the new spawn. I think it's pretty damn beast. Uh, this is all back here. I don't know what any of this is. But that's not important. So let's go back here and see what else we got. Well, this is pretty cool. Nice little spawn area. Nice little spawn area. Very, very enjoyable to look at. They did a great job with this. And how they trim these trees up are beautiful. Hmm. Pretty beautiful. Let's see what's in here. Let's let another. Wait a minute. It looks like the creeper blocks. The blocks have creeper faces on them. That's pretty cool. Um, what else? I don't. I just like enjoying and uh, viewing. Oh, I'm not allowed to go in there. Well, it seems to be that this looks kind of like a, some kind of a church area. I don't know if they have like a Sunday mass or whatever it is here on Minecraft uh, in this area. But this looks like a church or some sort or some kind of uh, auditorium where they would have something. I don't know. Uh, but there's a stage up there and there's a bunch of booths to sit in. Lights. Uh, some glowstone everywhere. World server. Saving world. Say, expect lag. So they got the automatic server save on. What else do they got here? Oh, let's look at this up here. Yaush Craft. So they got the big Yaush Craft sign up there. It looks pretty nice. And guys, like I said, this is my second time on this server. Uh, I was on the server about two days ago. Yaush Craft, that's pretty damn cool. I was on this server about two days ago, and I started building a, a building, you know. It's not really, it's not going to be my house, but it is the start of something that I can build and uh, be safe from all the mobs spawning around me and uh, things of that sort. So, guys, we're going to spawn there. I did set my home to there. We're going to go slash home, and we're going to bounce over on into there. So, this is what I've been doing here. I did build this building so I'd be safe. I'm going to knock out that block, that block, and that block. And those blocks there. Uh, but I did build this house, or this building, whatever you want to call it. So that would be safe from spawning mobs. Because when I got over here, there was a lot of mobs spawning here. Um, I'm not sure exactly how, what, how I'm going to deal with the top of part, part up there. But there is a spot here on the side of the mountain. Where I can actually pretty much climb all the way up the mountain. It's pretty damn decent. Pretty cool. Let's take a look up here and see what we got. It's, it's quite an adventure. Looks like someone's building up there. But there is the top of my building that I was starting. That was kind of a structure on the outside that I started to build off of. Um, let's get up here and see what we can find. So someone is building up here above me. Private. JS Wing 99. 
Ooh, he's got a groovy ass little floor going on in there. I like that. Then there's a building over here. What is this? Oh wow. <laughs> he's got zombies in there. <laughs> And it's quite a fall, but ooh, ooh, there's something I do need right there. We got some coal here. We're gonna wanna get. Yeah, I definitely want to get this coal. So, let's get the coal out of here. So, guys, I walked into the gas station tonight. I went to the store, or I went to the gas station with my wife. And we pull up to the gas station. We're wondering why there's two cop cars there. We know you think maybe there was something going on at the gas station. Or if there was something uh, happening there. I wasn't sure. Wasn't too sure what was going on. So we proceed to go into the gas station, and uh, <laughs> what we find, there's nothing going on, nothing at all. The cops are standing over by the uh, the fountain drink center in there, in the gas station, uh, at our local quick trip here. And there were cops were standing over by our, uh, the fountain drink center and everything. And of course, what's right next to the fountain drink center is the donut case. So <laughs> it kind of lives up to the... Uh, the uh, old saying cop with cops and donuts and oh my god they're standing there drinking uh whatever it is fountain drinks and it looks like they're just refilling and drinking and refilling and drinking there's four cops standing there and they're doing this over and over and over and over so you can only expect that they're gonna go for the donuts next but <laughs> i honestly don't know for sure i'm gonna get tear this dude's tree down here i don't know or not, but I'm taking the tree because I need the extra wood. So, let's get back down here. See if he can't come to my house. Okay. Uh oh. Where the hell is he? Oh my god, he's in my fucking house! How's dude getting in my house? Ow! Bitch! Oh my god! Dude was in my house! Oh... I need something to eat. I ain't got much of the food. Oh. I'm gonna have to eat both of those. I don't have anything. Left. I just found those yesterday when I was uh when I was looking for some wood and I ain't got much of anything left. God So I'm gonna have to have the sword out here because I don't know why this morning in my house they shouldn't be actually you know what? Mm, let's put this up there. I don't need that per se. Um God. Shouldn't have any mobs spawning here, but no, I want to be in the safe side and add some more of those. My health should be picking up here soon, I hope. Oh my god. But I was digging over here. I started like a coal thing over here. Oh, you know what? I'm not even going to do that over there anymore. What I'm going to do, because this is not really my house, this is more my. 
my uh, safe lane, where whatever you want to call it, my little safe place. Um, is I'm gonna start chopping hole in the floor. Actually, this is gonna be like. Where I dig down. So, all right. Oh my God. Of course. Let's get this open, open so I have a floor to step on. So, I'm gonna need to make another pickaxe. Oh, uh, got the pickaxe out. Let's get back in the hole. <laughs> uh, I don't want to dig that way because it could just get messy. Get over here. So yeah, back to that story I was telling you guys about with the uh, police and their, you know, <laughs> standing by the coffee shop or or, or the by, by the coffee area and the drink area at the gas station and the um, visitor. What do you need help for? Uh, he's standing by the uh, drink area and stuff like that by at the gas station and the, the donuts. It just, <laughs> it's kind of, I don't know if you want to call it uh, um, profiling or whatever you want. I don't know. I don't know where you would go with that. But it's kind of funny that they were just standing there by the drinks and the donuts. But I don't know how it works. I don't know if the gas station actually lets them eat for free or what it is but they were just refilling and everything i don't know maybe maybe they got a some kind of contract with the city or something where the police don't have to pay for anything and they come in there when they're on duty they just you know come in fill up drinks fill up food get donuts whatever they do i don't know if that's kind of what they have a deal going you know for their services or whatever but Honestly, I think they should have to pay. I don't know about you, but I, I, in my opinion, I think they should have to pay. I may be hating on kind of my own thing right now, but because uh, I am actually in school for criminal justice at the moment, and the outcomes of it could be a uh, police officer. They could be a uh, corrections officer. Exact, it's actually what I got into it for is to be a corrections officer. Um... I don't know if you guys know what a corrections officer is. That's another name for it. But another name you, I'm sure you know what it is. He's a prison guard. Uh, that is a correction officer. And uh, that is pretty much what I went for. That's why I got into uh, the criminal justice program. Um, I am just about all the way through my associate's degree. Associate's degree is almost done. And uh, uh, starting about October, I'll be moving back on to uh, the bachelor's degree so that's gonna be pretty fun and it's gonna be pretty hectic at the same time and I think it'll be cool but you know when it comes to bachelor's degree and associate's degrees and things like that it can be pretty hectic at times um, I graduated school in about 2007 and uh, I, I knew right, right away that's what I wanted to do. But I didn't start going to school until just a couple years ago. Because uh, I just wanted to take a little break from school. You know, I was one of those kids in high school that just had a lot of trouble. Oh my god, I need another pickaxe already? I was one of those kids in school that had a lot of trouble. I, there was a lot of peer pressure. And I was just, just getting involved with... Uh, too many people that I probably shouldn't have. Oh my god! No, I can't get back up. 
Um, I was getting involved with a lot of people that I probably shouldn't have gotten involved with in the first place. This is going to take me a little time. <laughs> wow. Oh, I'm so stupid. Should not have came down here without a pickaxe. Should have made at least two or three of them. I'm going to be pounding blocks and fisting blocks for a while here. Holy shit. <laughs> I just think a couple more blocks we can do it here. Think so? But like I was saying, I might as well talk to some more while I was uh, fisting these blocks. But I wanted those guys that was pretty much, um, there we go had a lot of peer pressure so I graduated a year late um, I was supposed to graduate in 2006 uh, the same class my wife graduated with but I ended up graduating in 2007 because I got behind on schoolwork and all that stuff just because I was taking part in things that I shouldn't be doing I was getting into a lot of trouble and I was falling behind on my grades. So that is why I basically um, had to come back and uh, catch my grades up. So in about a year, I caught up about two years worth of um, credits in high school, which uh, I was pretty proud of at the time. And I never really saw myself going to college because I hated school so much. I was so behind. Never thought I was really going to graduate. And then I finally did, and it was it was just amazing. So I thought to myself, hmm, if I can graduate high school, I think I can graduate college. So what happened is I was in, <laughs> uh, just a couple years ago, I signed up for the University of Phoenix online. And I'm going through uh, online college uh, with University of Phoenix. Uh, it's a criminal justice program. And I will be getting my associate's degree real soon. And uh, as soon as I get my associate's degree, I'm going straight through to bachelor's. I'm already uh, enrolled in all my bachelor's classes. So I'll have a bachelor's degree and an associate's degree. But while I'm going through to get my associate's degree, or my bachelor's degree, I'll be able to search for a job with the associate's degree that I actually have already acquired. So it's pretty cool. The only problem is that this is going to cost about $50,000 or a little more uh, by the time it's finished with the associates and bachelors all in one. So I think that's pretty decent, pretty pretty cool. Um, God, I hope we find some coal here soon and some iron. Cause this is going really slow. Hmm. I guess what I'm trying to say here, my point is, is that if you're having a hard time in school, don't stop. Because me in school, I was having probably just about the toughest time anyone could ever have. Um, I didn't really have a lot of friends in school. I wasn't the popular guy in school. Okay, and I, I hung out with a lot of the the underdogs of the school, the people that didn't hang around with the popular guys, but they weren't, you know, quite the nerds, but they were just not the popular people. They were kind of like the mid-group, I guess you could call it, and uh, they just, there wasn't a lot of people, you know, for me to hang with back then, and uh, then I started hanging with a bunch of people from town, and it got to the point where there's just a lot of people that don't, uh, I shouldn't have been hanging with in the first place. Um, so guys, if you're having trouble in school, if there's anyone having trouble in school, just stick in there because it's going to, you're all, you'll get through it. I mean, I had the hardest time ever. Uh, I was picked on for being a chubby kid. Um, you know, it, it was just hard. So. And I stuck through it, and I graduated, and now I'm looking at me now. I'm in co Oh, my God, there's a creeper. I'm going to kill Keto the creeper. Where the hell did he go? Oh, 
You son of a bitch! You bastard! Alright guys, that's gonna be it. I'm gonna end it there. Oh lord. I'm gonna end it there and uh, I will be back with another episode of Adventure with Minecraft. So guys, if you enjoyed, please click the follow button, the like button. I'm thinking of my live stream again. You can check that out too. Check my live stream out. But uh, if you enjoyed, please click that like button. Leave a comment. Let me know what you think. And uh, maybe leave me some of your stories from high school. What do you? Well, how were you guys in high school? Did you guys like high school? Are you still in high school? And how is it going for you? Let me go. Let me know below in the comments. Let me know how you're doing, and maybe compare it to what I'm doing now. So, guys, enjoy, and have a nice day. <laughs> Yeah.